What's up, Chapel family? I want to give you a quick update about COVID-19 and the shoals, but also what we're doing here at Chapel to do our part and make sure you stay healthy. As you know, things have changed very quickly. Since March, we went to no in-person services, only online services. Now we're actually meeting with both online and in-person. And as things change, we need to go back to the constant that God is a God who does not change. Psalms 47, 8 says, God is a holy God whose throne sits above all the nations. He sits upon his holy throne. We want to stand upon that. We serve a king who is not changing and who is not caught by surprise. With that being said, we've had an incredible time worshiping in person with you. It's been amazing just coming back together to lift up the name of Jesus, to pray and seek his presence, but also hear his word and challenge and encourage one another. It's been an incredible time. We've also had an incredible time online as well. We have people from all over America who's being impacted by this ministry right here. We actually have people all over America who call chapel their home thanks to this crazy and unique season we've been in. And so I've been trying to keep up with all the COVID-19 cases in Lauderdale County and throughout Alabama, and I've been using a dashboard that has really great information. And as you probably know, we've seen an increase in cases in Lauderdale County. And so with that, we're trying to watch and see what happens because we want to protect our community, but also protect you and your family. We also, this past weekend, had one of our media staff people come down with positive tests for COVID-19. So we've contacted everybody they were in contact with. So if you've not been contacted, you have nothing to worry about. We've contacted all their team members, everybody they interacted with. We wanted to make sure they know what's going on and stay safe here at Chapel. With that being said, with the increase in cases, but also with that potential member or staff person getting COVID-19, we want to make sure we do our part to protect everybody. So we're doing this. We've decided, and not casually, we've thought through this and prayed through this, we've decided to take a two-week break from in-person gatherings. What that means is this Sunday, July 19th, and next Sunday, July 26th, there'll be no in-person gatherings online only. So you can still join us online. It'll still be the same experience. And then two weeks, we'll reevaluate to see if those cases have kind of slowed down. So we want to make sure the dust settles and make sure we do our part to protect our staff, our teams, our people, and our community. That's what this means is I need your participation. I need your trust. I need you to help us by joining us online this Sunday and sharing with your friends and with your family. Share the Facebook feed. Go to YouTube, subscribe to that and like that and share that with your friends or join us on our website at wearechapel.org. I promise you I'm preaching a message called Full of It. It is a powerful, powerful word for such a time as this. We love you. I'm honored to pastor you. We've, we've walking through this. We're trying to walk in wisdom and in care for you. So trust us. Help us get the word out. We love you. We'll see you online this Sunday. Be blessed.